Okay, we start out here with a piece of three quarter inch uh, tool steel or drill rod, and it has a taper. Uh, it's three quarter of an inch down here. Uh, it tapers down to uh, three eighths of an inch. Then this section here is. Uh, Turn to three eighths of an inch and uh, threaded for three eighths twenty four with a little chamfer on it here. There's a chamfer on the opposite end. Next, we have a. Uh, this is uh, uh, steel. This is aluminum. Uh, the you see here the. Uh, And this uh, head uh, here is is also threaded 3H24, and uh, the handle uh, joins it at that point. Uh, what is not shown here is there is an internal piece that goes in here that uh, uh, is also threaded and. Uh, uh, it uh, keeps the uh, the two ends from uh, uh, being uh, going in too far. So we have the uh, the ends. These are rawhide in this case, although it's uh, not shown here, but. Basically, these are rawhide heads, and they're pressed in. Uh, the ones I had were uh, it's a little over uh, one inch in diameter, and I uh, had two of them, and I pressed them in, and they they seat on the piece that's uh, internal in here, so you can't uh, push them in too far, and they're held in with high strength. Uh, uh, Loctite. Uh, this part down here is actually neural, and uh, that's not shown. Uh, the, the length of the handle is about eight inches. This is one and uh, a quarter inch diameter, and uh, of course you have chamfers on each end of it. And it was uh, a one inch. Uh, ID uh, aluminum tubing that I had. Uh, so uh, that's the uh, little hammer that I built, and uh, I'll show a picture of the uh, real thing. I don't have any pictures of the machining. Actually, the handle I uh, made some time ago, this is quick and easy, and uh, didn't take uh, take very long so I didn't didn't film.